Yeah, so in order to get that ram out, you've got to lift the box up. So what you do is you run a chain through the D-rings inside the box and you use something uh, suitable to lift the box up. So for me, I just use my big tractor here and hoist it up into the air, drop the old cylinder out, fix the uh, mounting brackets on the base of the on the base plate there and put her back in. Yeah, so this stupid thing here broke off on me in the middle of lifting a full load of gravel. So what's happened is load trail has welded this tab onto the uh, bushing part of this pivot and warped it so it's binding and because it was binding and there was so much rotational resistance when this scissor hoist was going up and down it was bending the old tabs on here which i re-welded on and basically work hardened it and caused it to break so not very good And then here's some of the other issues I've had. They welded the hangers in the wrong spots. I've had two of the hangers bust right off. So I put three eighths inch flat plate all along the bottom of the I-beam and then redo everything and then gusset it. And yeah, so low trail kind of crapped to bed when they built this one. So I've had to bend this back and forth with a big pry bar. You can see it sort of goes to the boat there which is good gets up to here and it binds that's it I put some extra grease in there just to see if there's anything going on obviously that's not the case you can see it's oval you can watch it right there in relationship to the tab they welded to keep it located on the pin what a freaking joke this thing's not much fun. We're gonna put a little heat on that and see if we can't get those to open up a little bit. We'll put a little heat right down in here on either side. Uh, ground it off a bit on the other side, get some of the stretched metal back down to proper thickness. Uh, what a pain trying to manage this thing on your own. It's not very light. part is in now I just gotta get the upper part in so for this thing here once you get that cylinder mounted onto the bottom pivot you've got to get this hydraulic ram braced and then you run that piston out until you can get the bolt holes aligned there then you can bolt it all up and be done with it Oh, it's all done. Everything's working. Get that big bar out of there. Up, up, and away. Yeah, what a pain in the butt.